<clears throat> so today I have here a USB Wi-Fi fan so this belongs to me uh, one of my kids have decided to play around with them and then this is how to broke the, the input so what I'm going to try to do I'm going to try to solder here the, the small piece between these two points here here and here and let's see if it works otherwise I will need to buy a new one um, unfortunately um, this microscope it doesn't have um, a space here to put like a, a webcam uh, I, don't have, I don't know yet it's in my input where you can see where I can see here on the, um, on the microscope but who knows maybe in the next couple of years I will have uh, yeah, enough money to buy one of them so I will try to use this small webcam, webcam here in front of the USB to see if, we, if you guys can see it otherwise um, I don't have any, any, any other option okay so let's give it a try so uh, first thing I'm going to do I'm going to try to put a little bit of flux on these sections here just try to see put in a better angle and then, uh, so I'm going to put here a little bit of flux and then with the, my solar iron I'm going to try to put some pressure here Let's see if we can solder from this side and this side so let's give it a try now I don't think this is going to work, but it might be a waste of time, but at least I have something to do to play around a little bit. By the way, this is the first time I'm doing a video record with, with audio and video so please be patient i i don't have <coughs> any experience talking here during the, the video so so be patient so maybe in the next couple of videos i'll be able to be more social just so i saw a lot of people starting like this that they don't have any confidence to talk during the during the creation of this YouTube video, so so I'll just put a little bit solar here. So I'm going to try to do some pressure here. That's Done. Let's see the second part. Maybe I will have to do some pressure here. Sorry about the smoke. If you guys can see it, but I, I don't have any film extractor. But oh, someday I'll need to buy that as well.
Well, I think this should be enough. Okay, this side is more secure instead of this one. So let me try again. because it's too much hot I can hold on with my fingers so it's quite hot here well I think it should be okay now no this is going to be just a temporary solution to fix this so I don't know if you guys can see here This is just well it's not so it's not very great but at least I can try to use this a little bit longer because I don't want to waste uh, another money here to buy an, another Wi-Fi USB dongle normally I use this Wi-Fi USB dongle for for my MacBook Air because one of the access points that I have at my apartment here it, can, it cannot reach the, the signal very well I'm not sure why it doesn't recognize so I will have to use this this small one here Okay, still alive for some reason. The battery of my MacBook has finished, so I have to put ba put it back in the the battery. So we're still recording. We're still recording, I guess. Yeah. So I'm gonna put I'm gonna put everything back together, the housing. So by the way, this is a TP Link. WN seven two two N. It's a good, it's a good. <clears throat> I like this because you can pick up a lot of uh, Wi-Fi device everywhere here. And this is also being recommended if you want to, um, for example, using power links to. Um, To detect any different Wi-Fi's and do um, training as hacking, I guess this is what I have for the as recommendation. So it's quite cheap as well. So around 15 euros, I guess. So now I'm going to try to if it doesn't work. So I'm going to try to plug on my computer as well. Let's see if it pick up the signal. Okay, now we need to disconnect here from my laptop. Um, oh no! Let's see. There's, there's another way. I'll use this because I don't have a uh, any USB ports available on my computer, so I have to use an external one. So let's see. Let's see if it picks up the signal. It recognizes. Yep, cool. I don't know if you can see it, but the light is blinking. Sorry about this. Maybe I need to pull down a little bit of the contents of my window. Well, much better now. As you can see, 
it works cool so I don't need to buy another USB dongle for this um, well this is is my first experience working here is my micro solo um, I know you have got yeah I know you have seen my channel uh, before when I was doing repairs for um, replacing screens from the iPads iPhones so this time I'm going to try to do more um, different things like um, especially on the micro soldering like repairing the iPhones uh, sometimes uh, even the MacBooks uh, even Game Boys like for this example I have a, a Game Boy here console they have bought on eBay so I'm going to try to restore it and see if we can put it back again uh, alive so this this one i have bought on the ebay auction it's quite cheap it came from J japan it's not working so let's see if i can try to recover this and uh, i will try to put on um, one of my videos on the youtube so um this is the first time that i'm doing this video so uh, for the people if, if you don't uh, like it it's up to you and um, this is the f as I told this is the first time I tried to do this uh, by myself so be patient and uh, I hope I can bring you more videos and something that we can do more repairs okay so thank you very much please um, if you like it just uh, sub subscribe my channel and uh, I will try to put more videos as soon as possible thank you have a good one